like the enthusiasm of our team. I like the youthfulness of our team. I think we got guys that can really score the ball. On the other end, we got to, got, we got to have guys that can defend and get stops. Uh, but I think you're going to see an exciting group that plays together. They enjoy, you know, rooting for one another, playing for one another. So it's going to be exciting. You know, uh, years prior, I've been a role player. You know, sat on the bench, had other guys like lead me. So it's kind of weird, like leading these younger guys. But I mean, I'm up to the challenge, you know, and I look forward to every day trying to get these guys on the best foot forward and just try to be the best leader I can. Um, the transition, it's been easy. You know, uh, last year, the seniors, they taught me a lot. So now I'm just teaching our new guys a lot too. Our expectations are just to get better each and every day that we come out to practice and get better in the games and learn from the thing, learn from our mistakes. And then as the year goes on, you know, get ready for conference play and and then at the end, get ready for the MAC tournament and see what we do then. We uh, focus a lot on, you know, getting everybody in shape, you know, going two days and stuff. Coach Bag's been really hard on us, really tough on us, but it's for the better because we got so many new guys. So kind of get everybody acclimated to our system. And that's the that's the tough part, getting everybody on the same page. But we worked really hard in the preseason. And, you know, we still got we still got some strides to do, some work to do. But uh, we'll get all together. Yeah, one thing, let's talk about Anthony Doran first. He's doing a really good job of leading the guys. I know he's only a junior, but having not having a senior on our roster, he's, him and Keel and I is both are doing a good job being leaders. I think the preseason going pretty well. You know, everybody's getting to know each other, and we're getting to know how each other play, and so far we're really clicking. Stevie is just at another level for us, playing with a lot of confidence, really directing our team, really doing a great job at the point guard position. Um, and really scoring the ball. He, but, you know, for him, it's all about, you know, finding the guys, getting them the ball, and then taking care of himself in the end. And um, he's just going to be a guy that's going to compete night in and night out and make sure, you know, we execute our offense. My expectations for the team, you know, get better every day, just get better in practice and in the games, and just win more games than they expect us, because they said we're like six or seven. Yeah, and I don't really like that at all. But for me, my personal goal is like, um, just get, keep everybody involved, not really like, I don't know. Just keep everybody involved, make sure everybody gets these touches. As far as standings in the MEC, you know, I always want to win the MEC. You know, finish the regular season, hopefully top three, that's my goals. You know, they picked us like sixth and seventh. seventh. I was like, I thought that was kind of disrespectful, but one of my main goals is just getting better every day. You know, from, from me to also to the team, to the coaches, just we all get better every day and just play together. Yeah, our non-conference schedule is another tough one. Every year we try and play a tough schedule. That's just to really more or less get us ready for conference play. I think those are all formidable opponents that'll do well in their league. So, you know, it'll give us the experience of just getting better, understanding that if we can play that type of comp uh, competition night in and night out, that when it comes time for our MAC play, those teams are, our teams are comparable, you know. And so we'll, we'll have a chance to really compete and be comfortable competing against the, the likes in our, in our conference. We'll